Well, police were investigating here on Elmwood Avenue for close to five hours. The police cruiser and moped were both here on the sidewalk, but have since been towed away. And there was also a stop sign knocked to the ground. A 24 year old man who was riding a moped suffered critical injury Sunday after an officer involved crash. Video sent us by a man on scene shows a Providence police cruiser following the moped and then swerving to the right. The camera then veers off and you can hear a loud crash. The video then shows the moped and the man on the ground and police rushing to him. I was in shock and then to hear that he's fighting for his life, you know, I broke down in tears. Guy's a good friend of mine, he shouldn't be going through that. Just kind of messed up how, uh, Got an officer chasing a guy. Uh, he's legit. His bike is registered and insured. He's a semi pro rider, a good man. Chief Clement says police were following up to 300 ATVs and mopeds driving around the city Sunday evening. Earlier this month, more than 30 bikes and ATVs were taken by police and destroyed. Justin tells us he was riding with the group and saw his friend get hit. They hit him with his front bash bar, and that bash bar does. You know, that's a hard piece of steel and hurts, you know, it's killed, you know, can kill him. That's what, you know, it's in, then it's double the force when you hit the ground, you're whipping into it. So. Just before 10 p.m., a small group of people driving motorcycles drove by the scene, revving their engines. <laughs> Earlier, we spoke to Mayor Jorge Lorza, who says this will be an extensive investigation. He tells us illegal mopeds and ATVs on city streets is a long time problem. You have folks that want us to be more aggressive. But this is what happens when you're more aggressive, you know, accidents happen. And so it's just a really, really difficult challenge. And, um, you know, unfortunately we had this accident. We had this accident here today and we gotta, we gotta see. We gotta analyze the tape and see exactly what led to it and, you know, what caused this. And when we asked whether a police cruiser struck the moped, police said they are reviewing and investigating video to determine exactly what happened. In Providence, I'm Brittany Schaefer, 12 News.